Wendell, pack the extra rations. Duff, make sure the quivers are full and the torches are dry. Garrett. What's happening? We're heading north of the wall to deliver justice to brothers turned traitor. They're hiding in the woods at a place called Craster's Keep. I've been looking for volunteers. The cowards murdered Commander Mormon. We're going to kill every one of them. I'll volunteer to go. I thank you for that. I need every sword I can get. But Brit's going to. He took his vows in the Sept. He's a brother now. I understand why you hate him. But bad blood could jeopardize this mission. Too many unknowns out there. I can't have my own men killing each other. You don't want a man like Brit helping you. He's a murderer. Wouldn't be the first at Castle Black. Where I'm going, I need a man who knows how to kill. If you do come, I need to know there won't be any trouble. Even if he provokes you. Can I count on you? I need your word, Garrett. I understand. You won't have any trouble from me. I'll hold you to that. It's a hard road to Crestus. We leave tomorrow at first light. Now why don't you go talk to those two? They volunteered as well. Make sure they're ready. Dorf! Where are my arrows? Well, what did Jon Snow say? I don't think he likes us much. Definitely doesn't like you, Finn. He wants us ready for the march tomorrow. Just give the word. I'm tired of being under Frostfinger's boot all the time. You do know we're heading off to fight a band of murderers, right? That's why you bring a ranger. Point is, he doesn't want any problems with you going to Craster's. Well, there's something you should know then. <laughs> I, uh, borrowed this from you. <laughs> what? I just got curious. I wanted to know why your uncle was here. It never ends with you. It didn't mean no harm, honest. I just wanted a quick look. I wasn't stealing. That's mine. Hand it back. Of course. I, I wasn't stealing. I, I was just taking a peek. But the thing is, I noticed this part here. North Grove. That's just some shit story for little kids. A rumor. No, it's not. Of course it is. I heard it's a witch's den where they turn children into giants. Garrett, you don't actually take it seriously, do you? It's a fairy tale. For idiots. Everyone knows that. Didn't think you were that gullible. You're wrong, Finn. It's more than a rumor. Lord Forrester found the truth, it's real. And this says it's somewhere in the north. On the other side of the wall. And here I thought you might have some brains, Garrett. You deserve each other. Have fun chasing your tails. Good. Didn't need him anyway. What do you mean? Finn doesn't know about the mammoths. Or white walkers. Or how to sneak past a giant. What, and you do? But you know, it's the things you hear about. The rumors is all. I wouldn't know myself. <laughs> Where'd you hear these rumors? You know, I can't, I can't really remember. I, uh, I hear things around Castle Black. People talk. Not about the North Grove, they don't. Would you do? Probably heard you talking about it. Or, or maybe one of the recruits. Don't make me regret lying about the knife for you, Cotter. Tell me what you know. All right. Right. I've been on the other side of the wall, Garrett. You see, I, I live there, in the north. I'm part of the Free Folk. People round here call wildlings. I know, I know, it's crazy. I, I was with some other Free Folk. We were looking for weapons, south of the wall. We got caught, so, so I passed myself off as a local, and, well, well, they sentenced me here. 
to Castle Black for steel. I shouldn't be here. This isn't my place. Are you putting me on, Cotter? I wouldn't joke about that. They'd kill me if they found out. Are we... We still friends? I mean... I know it's a lot to take in. Your people want war with my people. I don't see how we can be friends. Just as long as we're not enemies, I suppose. Cutter! What did I say? That shit house you fixed is still leaking! I'll be right there. I'm going back home. No matter what, Garrett. I've heard stories. Old tales of a secret forest within a forest. Your lord knew what he was talking about. You know where the North Grove is? No. But I'll help you find it. I'm deserting anyway. Heading back home. I can guide you. Keep you alive. Stick with me and I'll show you the way. Plenty of things out there when I kill you. I don't understand. Why would you want to help me? The North Grove has nothing to do with you. I've got my own reasons for going. Cut her! Now! Uh, on the way! Please, don't tell anyone about me. The watch would kill me if they found out. Marine still smells like shit, even outside the walls. We'll find Croft here, somewhere. Yeah. <sighs> You right? <sighs> Never better. <laughs> Back under the Mad King, they used to say death by sword was a sweet kiss. But fire would fuck you hard. Funny. No. No, not very. I'll go find Croft's tent. Asher, I need you to tell me the truth. I've come a long way to bring you home. Back in that cave, you made a choice. You must have thought only one of us was going to survive. Now, it's not a fair question to ask, but I need to know. I fought beside you, Uncle, too many times to count. I figured you could handle yourself. Beska was the one face to face with a dragon. I appreciate the respect, but it's not about that. Look, I can't blame you if your feelings about me are conflicted. Or your feelings about going home. Your family exiled you to this place. But I swore an oath to your mother. Sailed halfway around the world to bring you back safe. And I'd be damned if some dragon fire or your foul decisions are going to stop me. Are we clear? I'm here to help you. I understand and I know what's important. My family comes first. That's good to hear. But words are wind, Asher. It's choices that define who we are. Asher, I know where Croft is. This Croft, how well do you know him? Too well. I thought you said you were friends. Yeah, we are. We are. Great friends. Asher fucking Forrester! Son of a poxy whore! You have some balls walking into my tent after all these years with that mama's monkey grin on your face. Well, that went well. You get it out your system? Not by half. You never understood consequences, Asher. One stupid mistake cost me an eye. But you never learn. You figured you'd steal from me and I'd just forgive you? <laughs> Not a fucking chance! So how are you going to pay me back? Your eye? Your hand? Or how about your tongue? Croft, no! Be reasonable! I am reasonable! I'm letting him fucking choose! Look, Croft. What we did was wrong. I'm sorry for that. You heard him. Now let him go! You're not getting out of this with a fucking apology. Croft. I deserve your anger as much as Asha. Don't worry, Beska. You're next. Now choose, or I slice off your balls, Asha. 
Hey, a hey, man hey! betrays my trust. There's a Stop price to be Let him go! Enough! No more fucking about! Fuck you, Croft! Have it your way. You didn't need your testicles anyway. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was bloody beautiful. Fucking Asher. You were pale as a oh. snow bear's ass! Oh. <laughs> are, you, are you fucking joking? You bloody bastard. <laughs> this is why people steal your shit and take off in the night. Come on, you assholes. Have a drink. <laughs> Joden, the Khaleesi's best wine. Your friend has an interesting sense of humor. So what in seven hells are you two doing here on the arse end of the earth, eh? You're a long way from young guy. We have a proposition for you. Your sword was always the quickest, Croft. I need you and your men to fight for me in Westeros. We need your hellhounds. A hundred good men. Am I in a hobby's tip? Would I ever go back to Westeros? I've got it good right here. A grace pays good coin. I've got wine! Women! Did this Khaleesi make you a rouse cat, Croft? Curled up at her feet. Since when do you turn down an adventure? Since the second son swore to Daenerys bloody Targaryen. I've laid my sword at her feet, Asher. Perhaps we could talk to her. She's a little busy right now, commanding a fucking siege. Her enemies are nailing children up on posts for a hundred miles. And a bloody dragon's gone missing. <laughs> I know where to find her dragon. Ha! Unfucking likely. You expect me to believe you've just happened to have seen the one fucking dragon loose in the world? Black scales all over with a red frill running down his back. That doesn't prove anything. Enough of this nonsense. We're done here, Asher. I've got proof, you old fuck. Tell me what this is, if not a bloody dragon tooth. Uh, I wouldn't know a dragon tooth from a basilisk dick. Croft. I've seen her dragon. <sighs> Oh, bugger me with a bloody spear. If you're lying about this, it'll cost more than your balls. Fair enough. Come on, you son of a bitch. The beast's name is Drogon. You'll want to hear about him right away. And don't think you're going to charm her with that fucking Asher grin. <laughs> <laughs>